Hey, what's going on, do-it-yourselfers? So, I have uh, determined that I have a Coleman, I believe this is a 3400, down there it says 338. You can hear that the fan motor is blowing. I got three different options, low, medium, and high. On this one, the one that's on, on YouTube did not. Some were just single blowers. You can't control it. But regardless, if I turn it to low, completely shuts off. And I'll do that for now, just for the sound of recording this video. What I, have, what I have done is replace the sequencers based off of some of the suggestions. Um, what's happening is I'm getting cold air. You can just hear the heating elements turn on. And they do turn on. Uh, it's kind of hard to see, but right, you can see it right from that crack. I see another gentleman open up the uh, video, uh, the blower, and then you can see the heating elements better. I'm trying to avoid doing that. I wanted some community suggestions here. What I'm, what's happening is it's tripping my 60 amp um, circuit breaker, and I thought the sequencers would fix that. It doesn't. I have checked the proper voltages and amperage. Um, I believe these yellow ones give 24. It might be off right now because it's not turned on. Let me crank it on. So there's uh, 25 amps there. 25, about 20 amps there. I'm not sure why one's higher than the other. Double check, 24. That one has uh, 0.5 amps on the red. 0.12 on that one. I've also checked for voltages. So I saw a guy hook up to the orange one. I have four elements, I believe. So I check my voltages. That one gives, the red ones give 120, 112. 220 on the yellows. 227 112 on that one which is my reds and the uh, top one is 220 as well so pretty consistent on voltages there I do get 24 volts on the transformer at the top uh, I believe it's this one here's my 24 24 volts are all AC. That one's 32 volts on the on the red one. The one in the back, the yellow, is your 220. I'll double check it. 220. 220. And then the, the orange one in the back there is 0.2. So that's what I have there. Uh, I believe these are the thermostats right down here so i'm not sure what i'm supposed to get here exactly i do get the proper voltages obviously because the, the fuses are good i check continuity on all the fuses and they are working so um any other ideas why it's tripping my my 60 amp i would appreciate it this thing has a refrigerant uh evaporator and there's no room for a filter that's the other question i have how do you put a filter in this thing i know there's one at the door I'm not, I'm not, I'm not happy with it because it, I think it still brings in dust into the house. So, for those that uh, have an old '84 modular home, that's what this provides here is uh, is this Coleman that came with it, and I bought this home. So, any advice would be appreciated. Thank you guys.